Hey guys, so this video is gonna be short and basically this is just about um, the complete proof of concept codes for the to upload the um what should we say? Yeah to fully exploit the RCE on a tutor 2.2.1 and yeah. I mean, this is the complete exploit code. Code. I know it's not well written. Yeah, forgive me for that. So main. All right. So in main. Hmm. All right. It's not ideal. Too much things mixed together. All right. All right. In main, basically. Um, so we we'll get IP of the host and which is the IP of Rocky Linux in this case it's 10.0.2.5 and as for our Kali Linux it's 10.0.2.15 okay so right, uh, yeah, the, the second one is a CMD so basically what to execute back uh, hmm. all right so right um, guess this is it nothing special here so one of it will basically spawn two process and one process will be spawning the net cat mm, shell to listen um here you listen for connection on 4444 and right so the other one will start the search brand sql injection so search friends yeah it's basically this part retrieving database version lamb database version username then username password hash then password hash yeah so yeah, basically we can get RCE without having access to administrator account. So but anyway, we will try to re re retrieve administrator ID as well. The the credential for administrator and right. So we can also check whether database user has super privilege. So, right. So in the end, we will spawn the shell with the known admin user credentials. All right. So let's execute this. Right. So ten dot zero dot two dot five is the IP address of uh, Rocky Linux, which is where our tutor application is hosted on and. Yeah, we'll execute this to send back a reverse shell. Okay. Yeah. So basically, it starts with listening for connection of 4444, and after sleeping for 5 seconds, it will start to retrieve the database version 9. And yeah, I guess it takes a while. So I'm gonna hit the pause button here since it's. Not very exciting to watch this. Yep. Right, so yeah, we get database version 9 and get the database version 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 6. Okay, we get the password hash line, password hash. Mm. Okay, I mean user then it's the admin, tutor administrator. Yeah, this part is gonna take some time. Only after this part, we'll check for we'll try to get the reverse shell. We'll execute the RCE. So, yeah, let's pause again. Okay, so welcome back and yeah, we retrieve administrator username and hash. 
Yeah, you may notice it's the same because I'm um, super easy to set the same password. Anyway, yeah, we have spawned a shell. So we can try to make it better. Which Python? C import pd1 py.spawn. Well, who am I? PWD? Uh, yeah, I guess it's pretty good. Okay, that's it. Uh, well, we need to cancel it. So, right, we get our reverse shell and, right. Yeah, that's all for this video. Thank you.